is Brendan Smart. I'm the CEO of Leap Legal Software Australia. We write uh, software for small law firms. Sure. Uh, the stories I've heard tonight were as confronting as I was probably expecting. Um, I've long since known that, that the cliche of drink and drugs and that's why people are homeless is, is wrong. Um, I'm aware that many people who are homeless have found themselves in this position from, you know, they would have, perhaps many people have had their lives mapped out. I thought this will never happen to me. You know, I've made the right choices. I've done the right thing. I work hard. And so I knew that I was going to get here and hear the stories of the people who had made either a wrong choice or something had happened beyond their control. And they just spiraled out of control until they found themselves homeless. And uh, I was expecting that. And that's exactly what I found. Um, probably more confronting, though, than, than, I, than, I would, than I was expecting. We've heard the statistics. Everyone knows that homelessness is a massive social issue in Australia. And working in the city, you know, you look around the city, there are a lot of homeless people. And even before I became a CEO, I always told myself that once I was a CEO, this is the first thing that I was going to do. Um, and I have done that. And my motivation is just to make a difference. And part of me feels a bit guilty that we make such a big thing about one night in the cold, whereas this is the reality of many, many people. So it's a bit of a, it's, it's a bit, it's a double-edged sword for me. Um, I feel guilty that we sit here and pat ourselves on the back and look what we've done, but tomorrow we go back to our privileged lives. But at the same time, the funds that are getting raised, we are making a real difference. And to sit there tonight and hear the stories and see where the money's going and actually see the people that it's helping, it, it, make, it, it makes you feel good. I will certainly come next year and as many years as I can after that. And I think if anyone has the opportunity, you should definitely do it for so many reasons, obviously the reason that you're making a difference, but it really, it makes you become introspective. It makes you, you know, things can change like that. And I think as human beings, we tend to forget that and we often walk around thinking we're bulletproof. Uh, if you're considering doing this, I, I, I highly recommend it for the points of making a difference. But, you know, I'm gonna go back and think about this and look at my job in a different light and just, try and behave differently towards my family. You know, the hardest part is seeing the stories of the kids. I'm a father and there's always, when you see stories and you hear confronting things about children, it's always hard, but when you're a father as well, it's, it's, it's even harder. And I'll be taking some messages back to my kids and my family. So I recommend there's so many reasons why you should do this. Uh, no, just this is a massive privilege to be able to do this. And it's not, you know, everyone seems to worry about the cold and the elements, but that's, that's, that's not, a, the physical element side of it is not a challenge at all. If, for me, it's the confronting. As I said, I've known that people, this can happen to anybody. And that's why I've come to do this and confront it because it's, it's not a fear of mine, but it, it, it's often in the back of my mind. It's the things you can't control, that things you can do nothing about.